Here's an introduction to tools that we often use in the woods. This is a reliscope, cost about $1,200. I can do a lot fa fancier measurement with it. Saved me a lot when I was a contractor getting paid by the plot. I wanted a tool like this because I was a lot faster. I could do more precise measurements and kind of fancy measurements when I was working for timber companies. Some timber companies might want to know, they want to know the diameter, but they also want to know the diameter, not just a breast height, but 33 feet up. And you're not going to climb up every tree. So you can use a tool like this to measure that. And that tells them what the taper is. That gives them a better idea what kind of boards they can saw out of, the, out of that tree. What's this? Use to take core samples. In increment board used to make take core samples. So we screw it into the tree. We pull out, we use a spoon. It's called this little wand. Pull out a little sample. It looks like a pencil usually. And it's got the increments on it. And what's what? And so we use this to measure what? Years. Tree years, so tree age and growth, speed of growth of the tree. Um, we always use flagging, lots and lots of flagging, tree measurement devices, compass. What kind of map is this? Topographic. What's another name for it? It's called a quad map. So this is an industry standard map. I mean, I use a, a GPS quite a bit now, but I count on maps like this built into my GPS and my phone. And so it's really important to be able to know how to read a map like this. And I mean, this one is from Montana. I just pulled it out of my files and, and they're, it's a standard across the country. And what are all these little squiggly lines? Elevation. Elevation? What is another name for that? Sorry. Contour. Contour lines. So they follow the same contour. So contouring in forestry can actually be a verb. What does that mean? <coughs> Somebody says, go contour out around that hillside. What do they mean when they say that? Go around it? It means they don't go up the hill, don't go down the hill.